Okay, today I've got a, an Amana washing machine. The model number on this machine is the NTW4516FW. It's a relatively popular machine. It's got a great price point on it. It's an AT machine. It does a good job. The problem with this machine is that I've never seen one that's been sold in a retail store that comes with a fabric softener dispenser. It just has this little cap right here. And so I said, well, that'll be easy enough. I'll just find the fabric softener cap for it. When I start searching on Amazon, I start searching online and I put the model number for this machine in and it never comes up with the right number for a cap. It says either it's the wrong model number or we're not sure if this part fits your model number. So I've got, now I've got, this is the fabric softener dispenser. And the model number on it is an 857-5076A. And I got this from Whirlpool. Well, it's a Whirlpool part, which Whirlpool is the manufacturer of the machine, of the Amana machine. And I went around and around and around for days on this. I finally I called Whirlpool and got lucky and got hold of a guy there through customer service. I told him what was going on. I gave him the numbers off my machine. He said, this is the right part for this machine. And even I went back even afterwards and ordered it off of Amazon. And it still said, we're not sure if this is the right one for your machine or not. So, but I'm going to show you, I'm going to install it on here, show you that it does fit, show you that it does work. That way, if you're running into the same problem, you'll know that you can order this part and have it fit and work in your machine. Okay, now if you come in here on your existing cap and you look, and hopefully you can see it on the video right there, there's a little notch. And you just take a screwdriver, put it in that notch, pry it up, and that old cap just comes off like that. That's all there is to taking the old one off. And I've got my new part here. And it's just a... Just a little dispenser. And you just take it. There it is. It's installed. That's all there is to it. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to fill it up with fabric softener. And then I'm going to see if I can make this thing run through a load. And just let you show how all it does is when it goes into the spin cycle, the centrifugal force of this flings the fabric softener out into the wash. Well, I was expecting something dramatic like the fabric softener to come flinging out the top of this thing, but apparently it comes out through the bottom. As you can see, you see my finger is dry. I stick it down in there. The fabric softener is gone. So I don't know when it came out. I guess it comes out underneath or inside somewhere through there when it starts spinning around. But the main thing is it does work. The fabric softener does dispense through the washer. 15 bucks, you can add this onto your washer that doesn't come with a fabric softener attachment. It's easy to put in, takes 10 seconds to put in. It works great. So anyway, I appreciate you watching. I've got a link to this, uh, 15 bucks on Amazon down in the description. I appreciate you watching. Please like, subscribe, and share my videos. Thank you.